Hi duck hunters, Jeff Matura with Takeem.com. You know there's nothing more frustrating than finding where the ducks are and you can't set up there because your decoy strings aren't long enough. Now I have Texas rig decoys myself and they're great for shallow water but if I'm on the Mississippi River or traveling out of state and I really don't know where I'm going to be hunting for sure I bring another set of decoys along and these are rigged with a system that allows me to hunt anywhere from one foot to 15 feet of water and what I do is just use regular tarred decoy string and you can use either a J weight or a strap weight but the key to this system is put on 15 foot of tarred decoy cord and terminate it to a coastal snap lock and now you may be thinking this snap lock is just so you can quickly detach rigging systems from the keel of the decoy but what I actually do is put the snap onto the eye of the keel now leave it open and if I have 15 foot of string for say and want to hunt only two feet I will wind and wind and wind until you get a couple of feet left such as you see here now pass that string through the open lock close it and now that lock keeps all the extra string from coming off of the keel of the decoy and your decoy has a 15 foot radius instead of that 2 foot radius you want. Now J weights work really good they keep attached to the keel nice but the rubber wears out you can buy replacements but the J if you're hunting in marshes with a lot of vegetation really hooks up on stuff and it can be really annoying when you're trying to pick up quickly and move especially when you pull on it and pull on it and it comes flying out of the water and smacks your cold fingers. So I still prefer a six ounce strap weight which you can put around here, stay secure, especially if you cut your decoy line just long enough so that the middle of the strap weight folds around the keel because this tarred nylon cord stretches a bit so you wind it tight and it acts like a big rubber cord anyways but that's up to your preference but the key to this rigging system is depth versatility and for years you can do this also with plastic decoy cord and these little plastic crimp things but plastic cord and these plastic crimps don't really hold up well in the freezing temperatures of the upper midwest so that's why I went to a tarred cord and had to figure out how to make it adjustable but there you go it's a rigging system if you live in the upper midwest and you want something like tarred cord that's going to last forever versus the plastic cord i think it's a good option for you to consider good hunting this year and make sure you swing over to takeem.com we have a lot of tips up there that will help you shoot more ducks and check out our line of duck calls good hunting and god bless